February 14th is upon us again and along with it comes Valentine's Day traditions. But not everyone celebrates the day of love with flowers or cards. Here's a look at some surprising and creative Valentine's traditions from around the world. Hi guys, welcome to or welcome back to Sunny's List of Things. Come with me and let's find out how some other countries celebrate Valentine's Day as we look at 10 amazing Valentine's Day traditions from around the world. Enjoy! Number 10. Denmark The Danes, who love a joke, have given the holiday of love a sweet but humorous twist. Rather than red roses, people send funny, anonymous love letters to their intended valentines. These letters are usually written as rhyming poems on intricately cut pieces of paper and signed only with three dots. If the recipient guesses who their valentines is, then later that spring the anonymous admirer has to buy them a chocolate Easter egg. Number 9. France France used to have a rather strange Valentine's Day custom, which is now banned due to health and safety laws. Back in the 50s, on February 14th, young men and women would get together in houses that faced each other across the street. They would call out and shout to each other until couples were paired off. However, if the man didn't like the woman, he'd leave her standing on the side of the street. The girls who were rejected would then burn the men's photographs on the bonfire in the street. This custom became so rowdy and dangerous that it was eventually outlawed by the French government. Number 8. Finland in Finland, February 14th is called Yastamperva, meaning Friendship Day. It isn't a day dedicated to romance, but rather a time to celebrate your friends. The Finns are also big on giving each other greeting cards on the day. But instead of romantic themes, Finnish Valentine's cards portray the importance of friendship. Number 7. Germany. The Germans, rather strangely, have pictures of pigs on their Valentine's cards. That's because pigs symbolise luck and lust in Germany. The cards are mostly romantic, with piglets frolicking alongside hearts and four-leaf clovers. Others can be a little more raunchy, with pigs posing in provocative postures. Number 6. USA. In the USA, greeting cards rule the roost when it comes to Valentine's Day gifts, much more than chocolates or flowers. The Americans send each other a staggering 190 million Valentine's cards each February. In US schools, sending anonymous Valentine's cards is also a huge tradition with many schools putting up special Valentine's Day post boxes in classrooms. Number 5. Brazil The Brazilians, like the Welsh, do not celebrate love in February. Instead, they hold their Dia dos Namorados, or Lover's Day, on June 12th. The evening before, it's customary for people to perform love spells called sympathias. For example, to get someone to fall in love with you, you must write his or her name on a blue ribbon and put it under your pillow. Then, before going to bed, you must look up at the sky, count seven stars, and pray that the person falls head over the heels for you. Number 4. Wales The Welsh don't celebrate Valentine's Day because they have their own 
patron saint of lovers, Saint Gwynnon. This Welsh holiday of love falls on January 25th, not February 14th. A customary Saint Gwynnon gift is a love spoon, which is a Welsh tradition dating back to the 1600s. These intricately carved wooden spoons include symbols like horseshoes for luck and hearts for love. Number three, Italy. Originally, Valentine's Day was an ancient Roman spring festival of love. On that day, people would take romantic strolls and gather together to read love poetry. Single girls believed that they would marry the first man that they saw that morning. Today in Italy, people still follow that tradition by gifting each other chocolate covered hazelnuts called Vacchi Perugina, which are wrapped in a piece of paper that has a romantic quote written on it. Number 2. South Korea In South Korea, women give chocolates to men on Valentine's Day. If he likes her, he must give her a gift in return on March 14th known as White Day. If the lady doesn't get anything back, then on April 14th, called Black Day, she must go to a restaurant, order black noodles and lament her bad luck in love. And at number one is Great Britain. Did you know that the Brits were the inventors of the heart-shaped chocolate box? In the 19th century, John Cadbury, Britain's oldest and most famous chocolate manufacturer, wanted to boost chocolate sales between Christmas and Easter, so he invented the heart-shaped chocky box. It soon became a hit and has since been copied by chocolatiers around the world, especially on Valentine's Day. So there you have it guys. Which country would you like to spend your Valentine's Day on? Thank you for watching and I really do hope that you enjoyed the video. If you did then please remember to hit the like button and if you haven't already done so then please consider subscribing to the channel and turn on the bell notification so that you will know when a new video has been uploaded. Also leave a comment down in the comment section. I do reply to every comment and it would be great to get to know some of you. So until the next time, please remember to stay safe. Bye bye.